Hey guys, this is Vader here. Uh, in this channel, we'll talk about crazy stuff like HoloLens, chatbots, IoT, in which we'll talk about smart buildings, smart office, smart healthcare, etc. And we'll play some games just to have some fun with you guys. So today, we'll talk about HoloLens. But before I talk about HoloLens, I'd like to talk about VR, AR, and MR. VR, virtual reality, takes you to a virtual world where nothing is real. It's a three-dimensional computer-generated environment which can be explored and interacted with, such as uh, Oculus Rift, HTC Vive, and PlayStation VR. AR, augmented reality, shows you something virtually positioned in the real world, which means the display you're using is showing you the physical world around you which virtual stuff added in. Uh, for example, you can use the mobile interface, the camera interface, to show you which direction to hit in. Uh, or you can use a headset to play games such as a robot crushing from a wall and attacks you, and you can shoot the robot with your fingers. Uh, so that's an example of AR. MR, on the other hand, takes VR to the next level. Instead of just being a layer, layer on top of the world, MR shows the digitally rendered objects into our real environment, such as holograms. And that, my friends, is HoloLens. Now I'll talk about what HoloLens is made of. Uh, it has lenses in display, it, is, it has two inbuilt displays, and it is transparent so you can look at your surrounding while you're looking at the hologram. It has uh, sensors that detects the wearer's movement, so it can adjust it accordingly. And it has two buttons, uh, one for adjusting the volume and the, the, uh, the other for controlling and contrasting the hologram. And it, has a, it is a computer in itself, and it has a CPU, GPU, and HPU. Uh, GPU is a graphic processing unit and HPU is holographic processing unit and it had it runs in win on Windows 10 and it has a vent which ensures that the device doesn't overheat because the HoloLens it has a power just almost like a laptop it it can overheat so vent uh, makes it cool so this was it guys um, next video I'll talk about how HoloLens help different industries like uh, engineering, schools, and healthcare. So if you like this video, please click on the like button and press the subscribe and notification bell so you get notified when I upload the next video. So see you in the next video guys.